tell me some more about some of the symptoms that you had. I'm interested in hearing about um, what it actually feels like to be manic. What does it feel like internally? What happens within your body? What happens in your mind um, well, you when you're feel, having a manic episode? Uh, I felt uh, kind of very tense, um, like my mind was racing, that I was making unusual connections, that I couldn't sleep at night. Um, you know, I felt like I had a lot of energy to do a lot of pro projects. And actually, before I was diagnosed... Um, there was one summer and I was teaching at Wheaton College and in one summer I designed a new course. I took a Wheaton College alumni to China. I mounted an archaeological dig for Wheaton College students in France. Um, and I got married that summer, all in one summer. Wow. And, you know, I wasn't diagnosed, but I think that kind of was seen as very productive um, in the workplace. But in retrospect, it felt like, whoa, where did all that energy come from? Or yeah, it looked like, you know, was I just nuts, you know, taking on that much in retrospect. Mm -hmm. And, um, you know, they were all successful. And uh, But I just, now that I've had therapy and been medicated, I, I try and pace my life a little mm -hmm. better. So. Are there bodily symptoms that go along with that experience as well? Like, I mean, you talked about a decreased need for sleep and, and an increase in energy, but is there, does your body actually feel differently? when? Well, I, you feel tension. I, I would say I felt tension in my body. Okay. Uh, I don't okay. think my body felt that okay. differently. Okay. And what about the other side of a bipolar disorder? What about the depressed times? Have you had periods where you felt depressed or You know, slugged. I've been very lucky. I've only had one depressive episode. And that made it very difficult to concentrate, uh, to get out of bed. Mm -hmm. um, it was a very agitated depression. I kind of lost interest in things that had been interesting to me. Um, and that responded very well to one of the older antidepressants, imipramine. Mm -hmm. And I was probably out of the depression within three to four months. Okay. Stayed on the antidepressant for nine months. Mm -hmm. um, but I, in terms of the scale, I was more on the hypomanic, manic, psychotic end than the depressive end. Okay. I would imagine that those more psychotic times are um, pretty uncomfortable and frightening. Yeah, extremely uncomfortable and frightening. And yet, the manic, more manic piece without the psychotic feature. Um, I'm not sure that that, descri that your description of it is that it's so terrible. It sounds like you were able to get a lot done and accomplish a lot of things. Um, yeah, it's a lot. You can accomplish a lot of things. It's a, it's a lot of fun. Um, people, you know, generally reward you in some sense for getting this all done. I have to say um, that my work is much better accepted in the workplace now that I've had medication because okay. when you're racing at that level, you tend to alienate people.